in an all Japanese matchup. I think, I think Yukido is predominantly self funded as well, though, which is so impressive. Yeah, here. Really burst onto the scene after uh, defeating Daigo, I think it was at a Japanese ranking event. Yeah. Oh, man, nice. So we're going to see uh, Yukido uh, utilizing a lot of the mobility uh, that Nash has. And Fudo. It's such a clean Miko. It's so good at weird that. to say that there's a clean Miko, but. Bosa shoots the double leg. That's probably the, the most amount of corner. command grabs I've seen Fudo do in one round. He's not a command grab heavy Mika. Oh man, and those command grabs just messed up Yukidon's decision making. You saw there, he just didn't want to stay still. I think that's so effective, using those command grabs at the very start when you're not really going to be looking for them. Do it early and put the fear in him for the rest of the set. It's a very similar theory in terms of using your reversal. Use them at the start of the set to show your opponent that you're going to take advantage oh of them. Goodness, this secret. And I guess keep using them if they're still working. <laughs> oh, man. oh, that Rudo was in full flow. To the clap. Goes to the reset. Oh man, everything just jumping. working. Absolutely everything. Spot on here for Fudo. The meaty throw doesn't get tech neither. This is oh, a man. clinic wow. right now from Fudo. Wow. Yukodon unable to get anything going there. Fudo looking very comfortable, very confident indeed. As if he knows what, what Yukodon wants to do. Just, just does the opposite and counters it. I mean, Fudo's been really active all oh. season. So in terms of the Nash matchup, that's going to be very well studied. Great strategy in this, as you. I like see. this choice. Take him after a, after a, a match. I mean, we saw some guys go go two zero down yeah. very quickly yesterday, and they and these are the these guys were going straight into the next game. Yeah, if you lose a game that bad, take a moment. Just take a moment. What happened? You know, I'm I'm in the top eight. I'm in the. How top did I eight get eight. hit all of those times? What happened? What were the situations there? What was Fudo looking to do at very specific ranges? Not like this. He's jumping. I didn't come all this way to lose like this. Definitely not. Let's figure it out. We'll see if um, that momentary recap has done it for Yukadon. He definitely needs to change it up. Doesn't have a secondary as far as I know. Not one capable of performing against Fudo. A lot of this stuff is very, you know, it's very hard read based from Fudo. He's not reacting to a lot of things. The jump ins, the command yeah. grabs, they're all hard reads. It's so clever for Fudo to play like that. He just doesn't usually play like that. Nice. Fainted for the cross beyond under and he didn't go for it. Nice blocks. Love that jump back jab anti air. So Bonchan infiltration like. Oh, Burns is so good. He's just scared to stay still. You see, he's just desperate to get away. Great activation. In command grab too many times. Oh, oh what a jump back air throw was so smart. Beautiful escape there from Yukado. He's fishing for that hard punch. Oh man, that's nice confirmed. And this is much better here from Yukidon. He's actually contesting. Yeah. He's round keeping that space. Slow it down. Oh, trying to extend it, man. I think he I think he had to do that because the second hit could have possibly whipped it. Probably right. Big punish on the way down. Oh, he's lost that round. He played Didn't so that well that round. Just all uphill. Fudo just too, 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 too persistent. His aggression really paying off here. Not giving Yukidon a chance to think. Open the round with shooting peach. Yeah, man, there's no respect. Nice whiff punish on the drop kick there. That medium buffer connects. And Rudo is still playing preemptive. He's putting those buttons out. We see, obviously, Mika's throw that clap out, but he's throwing a lot of buttons out there. And that time, just the Rago dashing slide. I mean, he's just doing what he wants. Oh, no trying to punish. That's, that's a big turning point. That's a big, massive turning point because now he's in the corner. Just jumps out. Looking for that activation again. Nice. Oh, no. Try to interrupt the drop kick. He's in big trouble here in the corner. He's in big there trouble, Logan. Step. He needs His to make the right decision now. Oh, he doesn't. Where the hell was that? Oh, my God. So harsh. He was playing so good that round. Well, he didn't go 2 0 down quickly. No, no. He, he made, more he made the adjustments. He made the adjustments there. A couple of unfortunate incidents there as well. He went to go and check that drop. It's, a, it's, a, very, yeah, exactly. the air. it's a very unforgiving game, especially against characters like Went to punish the right. splash too late on that, so that was an error on his part. He would have been into super as well off the side. Fudo just starting right where he left off. Tick for a command grab. 
forward fierce, lovely block string. Oh, a few reversals here from Yukodon. So he's taken all this pressure, but he's managed to weather the storm. Oh man. Fudo just so relentless. Great up the Ephra. Slows it down a bit. Nice. Good punish. Lucky that hit, it made the command grab whiff, but here comes Nadesco. Can't punish. Oh! He tried to mitigate Nadesco's threat in, like the, end, yeah. in the end. He teleported straight into <laughs> oh, it. Poor guy. This is loser's racket. He held forward on the stick. Locks not go for the super. Yeah, I think, yeah probably, probably the right choice. Great interruption there with that crash medium. Go Has he got a lot of utility for EX bar in this matchup? Not necessarily, no. Just a normal throw here. Just back that's his out. He does not want to be in that situation at all. Wow, gets away from the command grab. Super that. Loves doing. Here we go. No! Seems like everything Yukon Don tries just isn't working. Oh, the big nerves on the stage really getting to Yukon He's made a number of unforced errors. Oh, command grab. Fudo's not going to let this back. round go. He's absolutely up for taking this round. He'll spend the meter to do it too. Oh. Good v trigger activation from Yukon. Is that, I believe that's his first round in the set. It's been so hard. Every round, even the rounds where he played well, he's struggled to, fit, so struggled to close him out. Takes the drop kick. Fudo still on match point. Great anti air with that neutral jump fist. Wow, I like that. Nice. Cross cut up into juggle state. That's into the splash. So he's blocking that V reversal, but he's cornered here. Not a great position, and Fudo has all the resource to make this count. Oh, oh. too far. Don't press buttons after that. Come on, you good on you notice. Know great V reversal, he's out of there. Well spent. Slows it down. Charges in and gets the anti air. Great cross up. Oh, he didn't get the conversion. Bad roll there from Fudo, gets punished. Overhead. The desk out. Blocks. Nice block Come on, Come on, grabbed anyway. And this is where the oh, fight starts. That's the super. Confirm. He's so good at that. And that does a chunk of damage as well. It's two lights, but. It's over. Oh, Fudo looking incredibly impressive there. How is this guy in the loser's bracket, man? I mean, play like that. Well, he lost to Skazumoko. Did to, to give you a straight answer, yeah. but uh, on his way through, defeated Daigo three 0 beat Shahai three two, beat Mago three two, and dealt with Ryan Hart three 0 as well. That's a who's who's list of incredibly impressive names. You know, any of those names could you'd expect to see in a top eight of any.